No matter how many paths we you trod in this life, no matter how many roads you go down, there is only one perfect way, and that is God's way. God's way is perfect. Let's go to the Bible. Second Samuel 22 verse 31. As for God, his way is perfect. The word of the Lord is tried. He is a buckler to all them that trust in him. The way of the Lord, my friend, is a perfect way. You could try everything every other way in this life but the one perfect way is God's way my friend his way is perfect so this morning the word for you praise God is that God's way is perfect no matter what you're going through no matter what road you're going down right now you cannot continue down that road and unless it is a road that is straight and narrow unless it is the way of the Lord praise God it is the only perfect pathway God God's way is perfect, my friend. No matter what you think, no matter what you want to do in this life, no matter how many times, oh glory to God, you turn your back on God and, and, and want to go your own way, your way will not work, my friend. So many times we have tried things our own way and tried to put God aside and do things our own way, but in the end, we end up fail. Oh my God. So my friend, remember that the only perfect pathway is the way of of the Lord. His way is perfect. So put your trust in him. Believe on him. Call upon him. Take him at his word. Amen. And walk before him with a perfect heart so that he can bless your life in significant ways. Praise God. You have to trust him, my friend. You have to put all your trust in him so that he can work upon the good desires of your heart. Walk in the pathway of the Lord because the only perfect pathway is God's way. When Whenever you read the scripture, God will instruct you as to how you should live your life in this life and, and, and stay on the pathway that leads to eternal life. Praise God. So follow the instructions of the scripture so that your life can bring glory to the true and living God. Amen. Because the only perfect way is God's way. We want to do things God's way. We don't want to do things our own way. We don't want to do things the way that uh, the government said that we should do them or the way that uh, um, our, our, our mother, our father said that we should do them. We want to do things the way that God's word said that we should do them because his way is perfect. Do things, my friend, from a perspective of God, from the way that God instructed, from the way of the Lord. The way of the Lord, my friend, is the perfect way. Praise God. Let us do things, amen, as how God God says that we ought to do them so that our lives can be blessed and so that we can bring glory to his name because we obey God when we do things like how God says that we should do them. Praise God. Do them in accordance with his word and in the way that he suggested praise God Lord God Almighty I hope somebody get this word we should do things amen to um, the way that God said and instructed us to do them so that we can bring glory to his name and so that our lives can be blessed in return praise God because the only perfect way is the way of the Lord God's way is perfect as for God his way is perfect no other way my friend praise God it is only one road amen that leads to eternal life and that way is the straight and narrow way praise God the way that leads to hell and eternal damnation is the broad road oh God Almighty leading down to a pathway of destruction of eternal damnation eternal torment oh God Almighty we don't want to go down that way we want to go down the street straight and narrow path. Oh my God. So many persons will not uh, stay on the straight and narrow path because the Bible said many are called but few are chosen. So I want to encourage you my friend to keep on the path that is narrow and straight. Oh God Almighty. It is full of, uh, of righteousness and full of holiness and not everybody can live up. Not everybody can walk in the straight and narrow path. Oh God Almighty. But I want to encourage you to remain flat footed. Oh Oh, glory to God because this present suffering is not your final. What you're going through right now cannot be compared with the glory that shall be revealed in you my friend. So continue 
to serve the true and living God. Continue to stay on the perfect way, the perfect pathway, the straight and narrow way. Praise God. This way will lead you into eternal life. Praise God. And will lead you into the kingdom of God. Praise be to God. Because we are not working to hear depart from me. I know you're not, but we are working, my friend, to hear well done, my good and faithful servant. So be encouraged, my friend, to stay on the perfect way, on the perfect pathway. His way is perfect. The way of the Lord is the perfect way. There is no other perfect pathway in this life. Praise Praise God, but the way, the pathway of the Lord, the straight and narrow pathway that leads to eternal life. Oh, glory to God. Amen. I hope this word touches somebody and bless somebody and encourage somebody to keep pressing on this straight and narrow path, this perfect pathway in the name of Jesus. Let us pray, my friend. Most righteous and holy Father, this morning, God, we lift up your name. We thank you, God, for this pathway, God. We thank you, God, for our helping us, God, to stay on the way of the Lord, to stay in the way of the Lord, to stay in the straight and narrow path, because every other road, God Almighty, will not take us to the kingdom of God, but they will take us outside of that. They will take us into eternal domination. So we want to stay on the straight and narrow path. We want to keep pressing God Almighty toward the mark of the high calling of God in Christ Jesus. We pray, God Almighty, that you will touch the life of this person. What Watching right now and help this person God Almighty if they are not yet on the pathway that leads to eternal life help them to get themselves back on track oh glory to God so that their lives can bring glory to your name God Almighty and for those who are on this pathway God this straight and narrow path this perfect way God the way of the Lord that is perfect help them Jesus to stay on it God and to keep on faithful walking Jesus on this pathway God because they will bring you glory when they do so. God, have your way in their lives right now as we give a thanks and give a praise, God, and lift up your name, for your name is the name which is above every name, and at the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow, and every tongue confess, praise God, that you are Lord. Help us, God Almighty, to understand that the only perfect way is the way of the Lord. Every other way that we take, God, will lead us away from you, God, but when we stay on the straight and narrow way, God, we we will be led in the kingdom of God and we will inherit the kingdom of God. Praise God and everlasting life. Oh, glory to God. So help somebody today, God Almighty, to put you first and to stay on the straight and narrow path so that their lives can bring you glory and so that you, God Almighty, will bless them in, in, in due time. Have your way right now, God, as we say thanks for these and other mercies. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. And be blessed, my friend. Remember that the only perfect way is the way of the Lord. The straight and narrow way, praise God, will lead you into eternal life and into the kingdom of God. Amen. But the broad road, my friend, will lead to hell. That broad way is not the perfect way. That is not the way of the Lord. That is the way of the devil. Let us not stay on that pathway, that broad road, but let us come off of that road and come into the straight and narrow path, into the way of the Lord, the perfect way. Praise God. Let us stay on the perfect road going into the kingdom of God in Jesus' name. Be blessed, my friends.